Welcome, Slithia. You are watching KNC TV. It seems as though famous yet controversial TV host Wallady just got even more suspicious with his latest episode of the reboot Clash for the Trillion, revealing the old cast has been kidnapped and put on the moon. Though we still don't know his motives or if he's really willing to give away such a large amount of cash, we are determined to stop this object once and for all. So, do you even know how you work? Not really. All I remember is becoming conscious out of nowhere, with water all over me of all things. Ugh, oh, this is not helping. Okay, I have no idea what happened since I was knocked out by those lunatics, but weren't around here- I told you! In Sippy's words, you kidnapped 12 people and put them on the moon. Can I just ask what the glass shard is wrong with you? Oh, um, just trust me on this one, and uh, don't worry about it. Yeah, I should totally not worry about you being a wanted criminal. Uh, why would you think that? <laughs> what are you doing to Mini-TV anyway? Attempting to change their code? If I was, you would help me, right? Alright, Internet, help me out here. Why don't you think she trusts you? Wallaby? Just don't worry about it for now, okay? Oh, okay. I would watch out if I were you, kid. Oh. <laughs> hey guys, ready to start the elimination? No one wants to do the elimination anyway. Stop it, Graham Cracker. It's not like there's anything better to do. Oh. Uh, why don't we start now? We got 24 votes this time. That's less than last time. Great. Things are definitely getting so much better. What's our prizes this time? How about I don't disintegrate you if you're safe? Um, Wallady? Okay, it's down to the bottom three. I mean two. Okay, ignore me then. Definitely shows you're a great listener. <laughs> How can I lose to someone who hasn't even been present for weeks? You're right there. Paper is the one eliminated with only two votes, while you have only three. Dodge elimination again, I see. Guess I'm just lucky. Ha <laughs> ha. Well, he isn't. <laughs> Don't ask me. Ah, get me out of this fever dream. Wait, paper? Do I have something on my face? You're blue, though. And why are there glowy things on your hands? I knew about the water powers, but but I'm blue? Oba dee da ba die. Duh, what else be the problem? I literally just said that. Yeah, I guess I should explain that. During the challenge that involved water, I quickly fell into it. I thought I was dead, but then I wasn't. I found out that I had these water powers. Now, it's time to take revenge against Wally for what he put me through. You're supposed to be eliminated! Well, at least I can freeze you instead! What is that? Did you meet that? I guess. Did that piece of ice just talk? We're here in Colory. I think they made a child. Oh, my ceramic, they made a child. Trashy, can we keep it? Uh, maybe. I don't know. Is it biodegradable? Well, technically, I. It is a child. I'm just kidding, Muggy. Interesting. 
could a new specimen be created just with ice? Welcome to Silvia. Hello. Where did you come from? I don't really know. Who are you people? I'm Sibby, and these next to me are glasses, on cutlery, and graham crackers. Glasses is a nerd, and cutlery is just eh. And I am super cool. Perhaps I can run some tests on him. Then maybe I could find out what caused his existence. Oh come on, glasses! That's just inhumane. How dare you say that about our child? Wait, he's our child now? Didn't we just have this conversation? I was just paying more attention on my joke. Whoa, really? That isn't even anyone's child. Yeah, no, he's kind of ours now. I trust my muggy to take care of him. Do I not get a say in this at all? Just stop making me want to end you even more. I only have to eliminate you. I better get out of here. Wait, what? Is that a new contestant? A new contestant? I am going to go show them their place. I don't think you should. Hey, you. You are a piece of ice, right? I guess so. Then prepare to be shattered. Hey, you wouldn't dare. Well, that's it. I am going to call the cops. Yeah, glasses. Do that before you get ripped to pieces by this menace. What? Don't do it now. I want to watch this fight. No. I'm talking about calling you cops on Wallaby. The guy who kidnapped 12 people and is probably planning to do the same thing to us. Oh yeah, go ahead. That guy deserves the jail time. Don't do it. You will not be the one to ruin my show. I didn't even want the trillion. You brought us all here and expect us to follow your orders and it worked for some, but not for me. <laughs> it's just water. How's that supposed to do anything? Why don't you try this on for size? Uh, uh, why am I melting? Why am I melting? Looks like you got what you deserve, kidnapper. Or should I say, watery. Wait, is that my... Dad! Look, it's nice to see you, my daughter. But first, I need to deal with someone. What happened here? What is going on here? Well, we tried to disintegrate paper, but she has water powers now. It also turned Wallaby into a puddle. So he's dead. How am I alive? I'm a puddle! Looks like we're gonna need to contain him somehow. Wait, Wally never did anything wrong. Let him be. What do you mean? He is forcing random objects with their own lives to compete in the competition. That was never right in the first place. I'm gonna need some backup. Um, have you ever apprehended a living puddle? Heh, <laughs> a living puddle. Mini TV, grab that disintegration ray and put it on freeze. Freeze me so I can be solid and put an end to this madness. I don't know what to do. Don't do it. No! Don't do it, kid. Yes! All you need to do is switch it to freeze and fire. You have the right to remain silent, Watery. And I want no more trouble from you, Grey Glow Screen. Put the remote down. Is that a Wallady? I never thought I could be the one to apprehend him. We can put him in here. Wait, guys, uh, why don't you compete in my show? Uh, I know you want this amount of riches, right? Please? No one in their right mind should even like your show, Watery. It's the show finally over? I guess so. That was anticlimactic. Louie, now's not the time. Now that the show's over, what about the others? It's rocket time. After I fix it, that is. Hey, can I help? Wouldn't want you doing this alone. Sure, son. Hey, phone, you know, Bowtie's going to be up there, right? Yeah, still not quite sure how to feel about him. But I've been thinking about what you said. About him changing. Yeah, I'm definitely sure he's changed by now. You don't have to worry about it. Well, you didn't see in your memory banks. 
was that shortly after he got kicked out, I spoke up. Even yelled at him. It was enough to break him down. He wanted to change. But he didn't know how. I've helped him ever since. Glad to know he did have some good in him. So, this is your dad? Yeah, me and Mug's mother worked hard to get her to where she is now. That's it, this is all over. But what do you want to do next, Muggy? We do have a child to take care of, so that question should be self-explanatory. Oh, I see what this is. You two are dating? You wouldn't be mad if I said yes, right? Of course not. May I see my wonderful grandchild? True thing. I still didn't have a say in this, but hi. Oh, he's adorable. Make sure to explain to him what is going on. He looks confused. Oh, well, I am Mug. That's Trashy. And we are going to make sure you live a happy life. Um, thanks, then. Badger, it seems as though the Wally Ring Gun was actually pretty easy. Any reports of that containment suit we commissioned? The one being made by Dr. Marshall? He finished it a couple days ago. He just got shipped for the cell. Good. From now on, there should be no more of this going on. You better get going now, Mug. See you some other time, okay? Alright, Dad. Take care of her, alright? I'll make sure of it.